Mary Spinetti is a runner. It's something she has in common with Molly Tibbetts. It has also drawn her closer to the young college student. Molly could have been me. It could have been anybody. And so I just felt a connection with Molly. She started following the case when Molly was missing. Every day, that would be the first thing I'd wake up and see if Molly was found. Mm. And the day that Tuesday when her body was found, I woke up that morning and just cried. But instead of letting her grief turn to paralysis, Mary joined an online group started by two of Tibbetts' friends back in Iowa. They call it the Molly Movement. Members print out these little strips of paper and use them to spread random acts of kindness. I'm giving someone ice cream. For Mary, that meant leaving treats like candy and Baskin Robbins gift cards on windshields in Vacaville parking lots. I went all around town in the gym and a few people even reached out to me. Hey, I, I got this. That made my day. Thank you for being so kind. Eric Silva found one on his car at the gym. I think it's awesome. I think it's awesome, especially in her name. It's just uh, a sad story, but turning into something where everybody's helping each other out. Mary's husband says he didn't quite get her interest at first, but now he couldn't be more proud. And she went out and and bought all this stuff, and and this is something that she wanted to do. Is something she was passionate about, and I supported it. I really hope that people will take the time to look up Molly and to do something kind. The ultimate goal is to get you to pay it forward. Eric Silva says he did today when he was in line at Starbucks and bought coffee for the total stranger behind him in line.